of the first things I noticed. I walked in that corner and I started looking and I said, wow, it's pretty clean. And then I saw a piece of trash on the ground and I went, oh, I didn't see that before. And I would have gone and picked it up, but I wanted to see how long it stayed there. It stayed there 42 seconds. Somebody picked it up and took it away. It's amazing, and, and I, I have to apologize to to the younger generations because I've been saying for years that I, I don't think they care enough. I've been told by my grandkids that nah, they're too interested in Dancing with the Stars and Survivor Island um, or Big Brother House shows I've never even seen to, to take a you know to take a, an interest in what's going on in their government. They're they're hoping that it's going to rain and snow and everybody's going to go home, but it's already rained on you last weekend. And I don't imagine there's a blue tarp to be had in the store for, for 20 blocks around. People say this isn't organized, and there are certainly aspects of it that aren't, but I've walked around the whole thing now. I see you've got a medical tent set up over there, and people are passing out water. I haven't seen a, a, a single angry exchange with anybody, and like I say, that uh, I think Eric Cantor, or one of the Republican uh, corporate mouthpieces, was, was talking about uh, the mobs and how un-American it is.